Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Gerald Richardson, coming to you live with information about the bank robbery three days ago. Our sheriff, Matthew Cox, was pronounced dead from a gunshot wound to the chest. The criminals responsible have yet to be apprehended and are still... I have an offer for you. Three days ago, the sheriff of this town got gunned down mercilessly. And I'm looking for the guys who did it, but I can't do it alone. So, as far as the paperwork goes, you're still technically in prison, but if you help me do this, you're free. All right. I got all your old stuff. I mean, it's not much, but you should be able to get the job done. This will definitely do. But if we do this, we have to do it my way. I need to get someone. Someone? Can we trust him? Yeah. No objections. Let's go. Hey, old timer. Never thought I'd see you again. I need you for a job. Of course, you need me for a job. Listen, it's important. Can't hey, just come tell an old friend hello? Hey, listen. No! I got out of that life. Yeah, and I didn't. That wasn't my fault, and you know it. The situation was more complex than that. I'm not here to blame you or me. You owe me a favor. You owe me that at least. What do you need me to do? Biggest drug manufacturers in town. If anybody knows anything, it's them. and I have a couple questions to ask. Like what? Are you aware of a murder that happened three days ago? The sheriff? Depends. Who's asking? Deputy Green. I'm the law. <laughs> I got this one, he's the last one alive. Well, I'd say all things considered, that was pretty well. Oh, hell. What are you gonna do now? Death, you did. Mr. Rose? Sky. It's nice to hear from you again. I was wondering when you'd call. Hey. Now let's cut to the chase. Let's not get violent. Not because I don't want to start a scene. Because you and I both know, if you were to draw, I would draw quicker. 
you know, I miss you working for me. Out of all my guy, you always did it best. You always garnered me the most profit. I have a deal for you. You come back to work for me. You do a job or two. You're free to live the rest of your life. However you wish. I have to think about it. Alright. You know where to find me. But have it be known if you're less than keen. You won't have much of a life left. So what did he want? He offered me a deal. A deal? What kind of deal? He wants me to work for him just one last time. So what, you gonna take this deal or no? It might be my only option. Sky, if you ever want to get out of this life, you'll find it in your best interest to not take this deal. But until you can figure that out, I... I can't work with you. You're on your own on this one. Well, well, well. Look who finally came back to the bargaining table. I like the decor. Pious, isn't it? Oh, and the landscaping! I got it done yesterday. Oh, and I found this. Your old calling card. You know, the one you use when you used to work for me. Pick it up. Pick it up. No. Well, that's too bad. On your left! You should have taken the deal! You had the chance! You've grown soft. <laughs> Looks like Skye's in quite the bind. Timer! Old timer! <laughs> Alright. Before I kill you, I have but one question. Why? I'm done working for you. Hell yeah, you are. So how are we gonna finish this? I think we both know how we're gonna finish this. Ha <laughs> <sighs>